Is the city getting safer? The San Francisco Mayor's Office and Police Department are touting new really released crime statistics. According to their numbers, overall crime dropped last year, but in one category, the numbers are actually up. NBC Barry is Sergio Quintanas in San Francisco with a look at this report. 2023 is a year San Francisco got national attention for a lot of the wrong reasons, from crime to drug use to homelessness. But it's also the year the city took big steps to address it. Governor Gavin Newsom dispatched the highway patrol to help in the Tenderloin. The federal government cleared out a large part of downtown in the lead up to APEC. And throughout the year, the San Francisco Police Department stepped up a number of crime interventions, while the district attorney's office took a tougher stance on prosecutions. All of these things are starting to have an impact on what's happening as it relates to crime here in San Francisco. And the numbers appear to show it worked. In 2023, overall crime in San Francisco dropped 7%. According to the mayor's office, in the first six months of 2023, burglaries dropped 16%. In the same period, larcenies dropped 41%. But City Supervisor Asha Safai, who's running against Mayor Breed, says there's one important category where numbers have not dropped violent crime. That's why when you talk to the average San Franciscan, they will tell you a story about their own personal interactions with some level of violent crime. And so the mayor is still failing. Another mayoral challenger, Daniel Lurie, says the overall drop in crime is a hint of good news in what he says is still a challenging time for the city. We've had so many store closures. So much of, of downtown is, is boarded up. Um, but listen, Today, we, 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 we welcome good news. Visitors and residents of San Francisco appreciated the numbers showing that overall crime is down. I think generally San Francisco is a pretty safe place to be. Yeah. You know, um, there is problems with some major city. There's problems in every major city. Maura Judd used to live in the city. She moved to Maine a few years ago. So walking along Marcus Street from Embarcadero all the way to the Civic Center, what I noticed was that there were very few homeless people. It almost seemed the same to me as when I left in 2016. What do you think? Well, I think that's encouraging. Mayor Breed says the city is still dealing with an image issue. She's hoping the statistics and people's overall experiences will help start changing that image. In San Francisco, Sergio Quintana, NBC, Bay Area News.